and gentlemen, and welcome to Still Wakes the Deep, a horror game set on an oil rig off the coast of Scotland, I am presuming, as all the characters are Scottish. Um, gonna be gonna be great fun, gonna be great fun. Uh, I have some good news, bad news. The bad news is I have done this, I've done this before. Uh, I literally just made this video. Uh, when I did it, my, corrupt, my uh, file was corrupted and the audio was lost from the game. So, the first 45 minutes of the game, I know what happens. However, the good news is nothing really happens until the 40, mark, the 40 minute mark. So you haven't really lost anything, and I'm going to condense it down so you're not going to see me running around and doing stuff because be, I won't be talking, I know what happens, there's no point me doing all that kind of thing again. So I'm just going to just gonna gloss over that really quickly. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to start a new game. Um, yeah, like I said, I, I got about 45 minutes in, and I, I have actually got a, another game. But again, nothing has changed, nothing's happened, I haven't gained anything from this, I've gained nothing at all, apart from how to play the game. Uh, so, we're going to go straight into it and see what happens. Uh, and again, all the settings are exactly the same as what they were before, so let's get into it. I still can't believe you went. What are you thinking? Going to that place. Wish you hadn't got yourself into this mess, but you did. And you can't run forever. I know you were just trying to do right by me, so I need you to do what's right by us now. Please, Kaz. I am so tired of fighting. I just want it to be over. You home, the girls want you home, but if you don't deal with this, then we are done for good. I love you, but I won't wait forever. Sus. Jesus, Sus. The girls need you a Christmas card. <laughs> And Christmas. Kaz, Roy's finishing up breakfast if you want something. I'll, I'll be there in a minute, Trots. Right, well, don't wait too long or someone will be up with you. Aye, yeah, all right. And here we are. Uh, well, I am back. <laughs> but here we are for the first time you guys are seeing. The game looks great, by the way. Uh, and no, oh, that's terrifying. It's an open water. No, thank you. Uh, there's a letter that we just read from our wife Suze or Susan. Uh, we're in 1975, December 25th. So it's Christmas Day, 1975, and there's a card made by our daughters. <sighs> Sorry, girls. Won't be home for Christmas, which is a bit of a problem. But uh, looks like we're a bit of a bit of a boxing fan, uh, which is always fantastic, I guess. Um, I believe, uh, so I'm going to skip over the things that I know uh, in this and um, only find the things like this that you might find interesting. Who knows? Aye, quite right, Trots. Uh, to Cattle Management and Board, dear sirs, North Sea Oil Workers Union, Aberdeen Branch, gives notice under the provisions of the Trade Union and Labour Relations Act 1974 of our intention to take industrial action. This is due to your abject failure to meet with our response, uh, representatives to discuss genuine safety grievances from our members. We urge you to engage with us and resolve our valid dispute ends. Nice. So I'm guessing that's a that's a script that he's wrote for himself. Um, but yeah. So then we got the maps everywhere. Kelly Douglas. Can't go in Kelly Douglas's room. Uh, O'Connor. Oh, yeah, O'Connor. Got a bit of a, a bit of a leaky room, so he's um, well, there's mold everywhere as well. That's lovely, uh, but but yeah, we're not gonna bother with that one. Uh, Henderson, who's Henderson? Must have been back on shore last night. So Henderson's no longer on board. Henderson seems to be gone, hopefully, which is great. Okay. All right, Cavs. I'm all right. What are you doing up there? Pipes leaking. If it's not one thing, it's the other. See this whole rig? It's a pile of shite. It's falling apart. And we've only just started drilling. Fucking Cadal. And fucking Rennick cutting corners. Aye. Speaking of, you are in the shite wee man. Rennick got a letter this morning from the mainland and he's been up to high dough ever since. 
Yeah, he's gone in for you. That's just brilliant. Christ, I need a smoke. Can I find my lighter anywhere? Take mine. I don't need it anymore, honestly. You're a fucking lifesaver. I'm going to get breakfast. All right. I'll see you for darts tonight. We'll put a wee picture of Renick up on the board for you. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. See ya. Cool, and then, uh, as I remember, there is a naked man over here. I'm not going to bother him too much. Just going to show you uh, just show you that, that wee bum. Uh, so who's going to this? And, uh, oh, this guy is uh, a not very nice person. Um, I'm going to leave that room straight away because I know... I, I don't even want to say what he's... What, what, who he is. Well, this is cosy. Whose room is this? Gibsy Dobby. Okay. So Gibsy and Dobby is here. Lovely. Um, anything? Cranston, Luton. I know. Okay, cool. Um, that's the showers again. Okay, so off we go this way. I know my objective is just to go. There's nothing over there. Uh, so yeah, like I said, I've already played this before. Uh, but I'm just gonna gloss over the things. I went around. I picked up everything I could. Um, so actually, there is one thing over here. Uh, there's everything else locked over there. But there is this darts championship. And we are Cal, so we won. Uh, we won the first round, the second round. We won our quarterfinals, but then we lost against Finley. So the woman that was uh, doing the uh, pipes, she beat us, and now she's in the final against Brody. So that's uh, that's quite cool. That's quite nice. Uh, yeah, boss isn't on there. There's nothing else in here, um, so I'm just gonna quickly go around that, and I'm gonna sprint over. Wee. And then let's get talking. Look, there's no escaping. There's going to be a dozen mayor rigs up here by the end of next year because the pricks in Westminster want their grubby wee hands on Scotland's oh, oil. Christ, none this again. The bear is already down to the bare bones. And Cadal are just going to make more cuts to get other rigs on the go. If we don't take industrial action soon, this oh, place... come on! If we don't take industrial action soon, this place will be even more of a death trap than it already is. He's got a point though, Gibble. We're down to a skeleton crew in the pontoons and it's ropey as fuck down there. Workers of the world unite! What do you think, Kaz? <sighs> I don't know. Just here it affects the lecky. <laughs> what do you think will be keeping the lights on if this place falls apart? That's coal, you numpty! <laughs> <laughs> Good lads, good lads. They seem are. Uh, there are these pair. How you doing, boys? No bad, Kaz. Raf's here's a bit shaky, though. Gonna be the lad's first solo dive this morning. Is that right? Ah, you'll be all right, pal. Especially with the big man here looking out for you. Have you done it before? Christ, no. I'll stick to the lecky, thanks. No great in tight spaces, and it's blowing a gale out there. Really filling the lad with confidence there, Kaz. Ah, sorry, wee man. Don't worry about it. Brody's got you. Lovely. Can't talk to these guys, so we'll just talk to this prick. Enjoying Rick. your last day, McCleary. What's that supposed to mean? You've been a naughty boy, from what I've heard. Ah, give peace. You're not exactly an angel yourself, I dare. I'll be fine. Well, you're not me, missed. You wouldn't know a day's graft if it slapped you in the face. <laughs> I'd like to see you try and do my job. You wouldn't know a spark plug from a fucking hairdryer. <laughs> Watch your mouth, McCleary. Yeah, he's basically a racist. Nothing fun at all. Can't get in there. Okay, let's talk to Roy, our best Roy, pal. Roy. Cars Cars mill mocker. I do. McClary! To my office. That means no. Not as soon as you're ready. No. The sweet sound of Davy Rennick. You think it's the Paulus? Can't be surprised, Kaz. Have you heard from Suze? She's talking about divorce. Oh, I'm sorry, Kaz. She'll come around. Not if I get to jail, she won't. Well, maybe you could have considered that while you were battering Billy Chamberlain's head in. Cunt slagged off Suze. He had it coming. And there he is. Floats like a butterfly, stings like a bee, and swears like the devil himself. Listen, mate. Even if it is the Paulus, maybe it's best to just go back and face it. Yeah? Ach, I don't know, Roy. I'm fucking scun up with the whole thing. The Lord loves you, mate, no matter what. And I'm pretty sure Seuss does too. That's all clear for you now, Roy. Lovely job, thanks, Dobby. Oh, 
Trot says he's left your insulin in your cabin. Oh, bless his little communist socks. Muchly appreciated. Ta. Remember, life is like football. It's not over. Until the final whistle. Aye. You're a Barnsley fan, so you're pretty much fucked from the off, right? Oh, I will see you hand for that McCleary. Off you trot, lad, before his nibs blows a gasket. Love it. I love Roy. I love the, the, the banter they have here. Okay, now I can go this way. No, I, don't, I didn't think I actually saw this earlier. Okay, so that's, that's how this is built. Uh, none of these... The galley, there's nothing in the galley. I've already had a look. And let's uh, go to the deck. Okay, here we are. It's got a hard hat and our gloves. No, got to, got to follow precautions. And here we are. Lovely jubbly. Up to see what the score is. I'm all right to get by, pal. Sorry, right. you have to go around, cards. All right. So if you talk to everyone, um, if you talk to everyone in this area and you get down there, you get an achievement to. Uh... Okay. Um, you get an achievement to talk to everyone in the intro. So. Yeah, I've already got the achievement, but uh, that's the only achievement I've got so far. Uh, could go on the ladder and uh, make some difference. There's literally nothing around here at the moment, really. It's just a matter of talking to people, walking around. Nothing crazy. Like I said, I've already done this uh, this entire intro bit. So, uh, yeah, it's going to be a little bit tedious for me just to get through all of this. It doesn't get interesting. Need a hand there, fellas. A clearing. No, I can scale find a hero by myself. <laughs> no, we're all right. Cheers, though. Fair enough. You want to transfer here, McCleary? You give me less lip. No. He loves it. McCleary, my office. I don't make me ask again. In a better mood today, is he? You'll be all right, Kaz. You get used to it. We all get a turn. Try not to punch him. <laughs> no promises. I'm going to talk to this guy. Is it Pinvan right, R? Right, Roper, what's the problem? Roper, yeah. I usually see you down here. Trolls acting up this morning. Got the crew running around like blue ass flies, but they cannot make head or tail of it. Is that you's behind schedule then? Oh, no, not yet. Uh, not if the gods are smiling on us. So mere fuck than ever. Not as fucked as you by the sounds of it. Look, you better get up there. The boss man sounds raging. It's true, the boss man is not very happy. McLeary! Jesus, Scooby. <laughs> Give me a heart attack. Oh, sorry, mate. Can I ask a wee favour? What do you need, Scoop? Ah, oh, could you do me a quick fix on the crew lift fuse box while you're down there? I need bother. Oh, you're a lifesaver, mate. And don't let the big man get you down, all right? Thanks, pal. Okay, now we got to make a fuse box. Well, we've got to repair the fuse box to get up to the manager, which is fantastic. Lovely stuff. Yeah, up we go. Ah, so yeah, um, I'm, I've, this took me about maybe 20, 25 minutes earlier because I was really having a look at everything, going everywhere I possibly can, and you didn't miss much. There wasn't much in the way. I think it was just that uh, that one note right at the beginning uh, from Trots. Uh, apart from that, everything else has been exactly the same. And uh, at the bottom there, when you talk to Scooby, you get that's when you get the achievement to talk to everyone. Really simple to get. But, uh, this is an achievement guide, so I'm not going to worry too much about that. Go over there. Okie dokie, up we go. Oh, here we go, big boss man. Well, here we fucking go. Enter. Ah, Mr. McQuarrie. So glad you could join me and sorry to have got you out of bed. Shut the door. And have a seat. No, I'm fine, Stan. Sit your ass in that chair, you fucking liability. But I don't... I run a tight ship. Do you understand me? A tight ship. Technically, it's no ship. Shut your gub, you Ned prick! I am sick, sick to fucking book on a UE gub shakes messing with my operation. That chef might be a mate of yours, but he does not run things around here. I do. 
Do you understand me? All right, why don't you just get on with it? Don't you answer me back! You might be the height of shite on shore, McQuarrie, but out here, I am the fucking king. Do you understand me? You bring the police to my door, to my rig. Uh, look, I, I can sort this, right? I just need time. Shut it, you clatty gobshite. I've got here's a man who can make a more positive contribution to this operation than you. Look, I know Shut you. it! I'm in a meeting. What? For fuck's sake, Gibbo, I don't care. We're on a schedule. It's a fucking drill. You've got a fucking drill, so drill through it. Yeah, well, Roper's a whiny old fud. He's got a problem with everything. I don't care if it feels half. Just fucking do it! Or I'll come down there myself! That, uh, trouble with the missus? You're fired. You hear me? Fired. Uh, come on, man. It's only a wee bit of trouble with the polis. I'm good with the lecky. I keep things running. You said it yourself. Ouch! Get off my rig! I love I, I, I love the uh, I, I love Kaz. What, what a great person! So chill. Um, okay, I'm pretty sure we can just climb this ladder. Never mind, we can't climb the ladder. We got to go the long way around. Absolutely fine. Uh, yeah. Uh, no more running for you, guys. Nope. Um, but yeah, there's a. Uh, there's gonna be a fair bit of swearing. <laughs> it's, I mean, it's a Scottish. They're gonna be swearing a lot, but it's, uh, it, it's fine. It's fine. I'm not too fussed about that. Unless it gets me demon, uh, not demonetized. But unless it gets me uh, strikes and stuff. But let's ignore this. Let's let's carry on going, shall we? To get this helicopter. Christ, but you're a right pair. Two bars and a ball bag. Now listen, Pat. I promise I'll take care of him. I had a word with our Kieran, you remember him? You know, it's Billy Chamberlain from way back. He owes me a favour. Reckons you can sweeten Billy up a bit. Come on. Have I ever let you down? Roy, you lost the cake at the wedding. N now then, now then. Th that wasn't my fault. You left it on a bench at Argyle Street. Aye, you were that bloated you didn't even remember baking the cunt. Oh, my children, that was before the light of the Lord came to me. Here we fucking go. Uh, and you, Mr. McCleary, you can fuss and cuss all you like. But perhaps if you went to the Saracens a little less and the Tabernacle a little more, then perhaps you'd not be in this pickle, eh? Don't, don't look at me. You're the one who decided to spend the next four months trapped on our egg with this bump pot. Susan, I promise you, I promise you, we will get this straightened out. I will. You'd better. Christ! He's got gold! Shit! Guys! Get his leg! We can't leave him out here! Move! Fuck! Guys! I think he's dead! We got you, man, alright? We got you! He's breathing, thank Christ! Kaz? Wake up, Kaz! Why is he not waking up? Can you hear me? Is he going to die, Brody? <coughs> Kaz? <coughs> And here we are, the next part of the game. Just gonna pull my hands up, you know. Nice little detail there. I mean, I'm wearing gloves, so it shouldn't be too bad. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, let's open up this door, shall we? Guys! I need your help here! Oh, 
This will help this guy out. My heat's killing me, but... Aye, aye, I think so. You got me out. Did you get Gregor? I got you, aye. I couldn't find Gregor. Fuck. I'm sorry, Cass. Jesus. He's not the only one we lost. Oh, no, no. Rass is still in there. Why aren't these working? Cass, I need you to help me. Cass! What? Right. Aye, what, what do you need? The cable's stuck. Go down and release the main brake, then come back up and raise the bell. If you can get it to my level, I think I can get him out. Aye. Raffs, it's all right. We're right. getting you out. Let's help Raffs, shall we? So it means you can't sprint downstairs or upstairs. Engineering for here. I've never been doing this end before. The only way you'll get there is to go under the rig. Should be a clearer path down there. All right. I'll head down now. All right. So now we got to go under the rig, which is absolutely fantastically fun. Okay. So, oh, Jesus. Let me go down, please. Thank you very much. Like I said, it's very sketchy. Entering under rig. Four. Oh, I forgot about that one. Alright, okay. Well, that's not for. Ooh, hello. Hello. What are you? Okay. Anyway, time to try and get above. Sweet. Oh boy. <laughs> the first one did this, it was terrifying. Don't want to do this. And we're across. Yay! Like I said, I've done this entire bit before, so uh, so it seems a little bit underwhelming for people. Uh, but the next episode, don't you worry. Next episode, it will be all new stuff to me. Okay, let's get the fire done. What's this? And let's give it a little climb, shall we? Okay, here we go. Just keep running, just keep running, just keep running, running, running. Shite! You don't fucking see again. Let's not. Okay, so you can't sprint down the stairs. I'll ha In the previous uh, recording, I, um, I made that mistake. So you've actually got to go down and then jump here. And then climb. Because, of because you can't run downstairs. You get in trouble if you do that. Oh, keep going. There we go. Okay. Oh, fucking hell. Just get up close. Oh, 
so sketchy. So sketchy. Oh, we're across now. Cool, let's carry on traveling. And in we go. Now we're going to go to engineering. Very, very dark. What is that? There's a torch over there. Dual issue. Uh, there's literally right. Th th there's that right there, which has. An, it looks very reminiscent of uh, what the uh, the contact DLC from Armor Three. Um, even though I've done this just literally moments ago, I have forgot what I'm doing. Uh, okay. I forgot what happens. Ooh. Okay. Just keep on climbing. Keep on climbing. Keep on climbing. 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 And up we go. Okay, let's get our torch, shall we? Finally, something useful. Okay, I don't know if this is infinite or not, um, but uh, we're going to find that out later on. Okay, let's go. Lots of water, love it. Very slow. This is where it starts getting creepy. Luckily, I've got a screwdriver still. Somehow that survived me uh, falling in the water. So whatever brand belt I have, I want to make a note of that one. We've almost got to the bit where I got to. Jesus. Oh, I did not know I could do this. I didn't pick this up last time. Can I actually do something with this? They got oil or some shit on him and just, I don't know, he freaked out, went for me. He's still out there. You mean out here, as in out here with me? Aye, that's exactly what I mean. Oh, that's just fucking brilliant. Have you seen anyone else? I just got here. Where are you going anyway? Back to accommodation. Listen, you'll have to get through the water tanks to get up to accommodation. And quiet like. Got to go all the way up there. Jesus. What about Gibble? Stay the fuck away from me. You're listening to me. It's no right, cuz. I'm no arguing. Cuz. Be fucking careful, eh? Aye. You know. Okay, and then this is as far as I got in the last uh, recording that I did. So from this point on, I have no idea what is going on. Um, but I am going to end this episode here because. 
I don't want to just ruin it for myself. And obviously, I've just I've just done this recording. That took forty five minutes. I then had to do the audio, the editing, and then realized there was no audio. So I've just wasted an hour and a half. And I've just had to replay it again. I've got to edit everything again. It's gonna take another hour or so. So yeah, I'm gonna do this another time. But this is as far as I've got. I haven't got any further than this in the entire game. I've got no idea what's coming up next. So make sure you subscribe to see this one again. Uh, see episode two because I I hate horror games. <laughs> I hate them. The closest thing to a horror game I've played is Subnautica and Subnautica Below Zero. So, but but yeah, next episode is gonna be absolutely terrifying. Uh, so I can't wait for that. But I hope everyone enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye guys. Thank <laughs> you.